What was your first video? But additionally, mm-hmm. what was the first video that blew? What was the one that, okay, y'all know me from working with Director yeah. X. You yeah. know me from working with Hype. Yeah. But Benny Boom. Yeah. I'm here now. Yeah. Um, the first video was Wild Out 2K with Channel Live, which I was, I'm, I'm on the album. Correct. The Flavor Unit. That's my crew. Shout out to Hawk. Shout out to Tuffy. Um, that was our, that was the first music video. And it's fun, the funny story is that Q-Tip was supposed to direct that video. And that's who, uh, it was Flavor Unit Records, so it was Latifah and Shaquem. Um, and that's who was supposed to do it. And they said, nah, nah, we want our man to do it. And he was like, who's your man? <laughs> it's like, <laughs> this kid ain't never direct that before. We supposed to give him $100,000 to direct the video? Nah. So I had to write, I remember writing the treatment up, uh, getting it all perfect and everything and talking and being on the phone. And they, you know, hot and tough, really, they pushed the line. They said, yo, we if, if he ain't doing it, we not coming. That's dope. Which, which was, you know, I can't, I don't even have, we don't even have enough time to talk about that relationship. You know what I mean? Um, it was just incredible for, for, for him to do it. Um, and I had so much support, you know what I mean? I had to support our unit of, of friends, Dwight, everybody was like, yo, this is, so everybody came by the house that day. We shot it in the place in our apartment where we lived and around the area in Brooklyn. So everybody came through to show support at some point in time is like yo this is your first video you're gonna kill it you're gonna be big and this and i'm like i'm just trying to get through the day you know what i mean yeah. um but the first video to blow blow was probably uchi wally that Ooh, was uh yeah, uchi wally and that was my third that was my third video and it was um you know i had I, it's funny i had developed pretty cool relationship with Nas over the years from the hype world um and uh actually the first video i was the that I was the AD for was the New York portion of Hate Me Now because the first AD, Mike Ellis, had broken his leg right before it was time to come to set. And he called me and he said, yo, I need you to step up. I can't I can't come. I'm sorry, once he said, I can't come. Um, I need you to step up. So if you remember the video, it's the portion with the flames in the street. Yep. And, and um and Diddy on the um yep. on the store and stuff like that. Oh, he was there. So yeah. you remember um it was Freaky Ta's funeral that night. Freaky Ta who had gotten yep. murdered. Mm-hmm. We were on Merrick Boulevard, and all these guys kept driving by. And while Puff and Niles was on the, the store, they kept saying like crazy stuff, right? Like, you know for whatever reason, they felt like they shouldn't have been shooting a video. They should have been down the street at the, at the funeral. Right. So at one point, some cats from Queens that Nas knew they wasn't happy that they, that it was all going down and he comes down and he confronts them. And I, and I don't want to say this confronting, like, yo, it's going to be a fight, but he didn't go in his trailer. He came down and said, what's good? He says, yo, I'm working right now. I can't leave what I'm doing. Ty and, and, and you know, lost, but they would understand what this is. He said, I already talked to, to, to everybody. I already talked to Chiefs. I, you know, they know what the love is. It just happened to be on the same day. So he finished that conversation. And when he turned around, I was standing right there with him. Right. So he looked at me like, okay. I mean, you know, his people was there, but I was there too. And it wasn't like, let me not, let me clear this up. It wasn't about a fight or anything like that, but you understand in that time, man, it was like, we all we had, yep. you know? And I'm like, Nas, like, Hey, I wasn't going to let this interrupt my set. So let me be here to, to make sure that this was being handled the way that it should be handled. So he saw that. And so that whole day, those, those two days, um, and you, and you know, that video, you remember it was a lot of drama afterwards or what have you, but um, that he, he remembered that whole thing. So when Uchi Wally came up and he knew and he found out I was directing, um, the record label Columbia told him that I was directing now. And he was like, oh, that's son. Oh, that's hype. Mint. So, oh, word. That's what's up. Let him write for it. And then I went up to Columbia and they played the record for me and I wrote the treatment and we were shooting in Miami like a week later. So. What's up guys, thanks for sticking with me to the end of the video. Truly appreciate you. 
If you like anything you heard here today, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And if you know anybody that can benefit from this message, feel free to share. Peace and love.